what is creativity and why do we use it in virtual facilitations? First of all, creativity is a capacity and not a skill. Opera singing is a skill, calligraphy is a skill, but the creativity behind that skill is a capacity as a capacity that we all have. So I always like to talk about the fact that if there's one universal tool we should be training on, it's creativity. You can train me on accounting all you want, and I'm never really going to quite get it. You might be able to train someone else on sales, but they might not quite get it. But if you incorporate creativity into your training tools, what you're doing is tapping into a capacity, a natural innate ability that we all have. Creativity also challenges our way of thinking. It allows us to form ideas from different perspectives. It also gives us access to ideas that are untapped by left brain thinking alone. If you look at this picture here, you see with left brain thinking, you can get some ideas, but the ideas don't become vibrant until you add in that right brain creative thinking. Now, why bring this into virtual facilitations? First of all, by bringing creativity into a virtual facilitation, you're keeping your audience engaged in their learning. Creativity also leaves people energized rather than feeling drained, which can happen when we're sitting in front of a computer screen. It also creates this opportunity for connection and collaboration that is missing by not being in the workplace right now. And it also offers an experience and an emotional connection. And that is something that we want to draw out in people as we work virtually and from home.